Good morning. Milk and multiple sclerosis. Is it possible that milk consumption is triggering or is involved in the pathogenesis of multiple sclerosis? A new paper published in PNS on January 26, 2022, basically by Stephanie Querten from the University of Heidelberg uh, in Germany and Bonn uh, University shows that there is uh, an antibody cross reactivity between casein, that is one of the component, one of the proteins of milk, and myelin associated glycoprotein uh, resulting in central nervous system demyelinization. So we knew, we knew, so this is the, the, the significant, we knew that uh, basically, or, or there was a suggestion that uh, people who were uh, drinking uh, cow's milk had a, a higher prevalence of multiple sclerosis. As you know, multiple sclerosis is the most prevalent and debilitating autoimmune disease of the central nervous system, especially in, in young adults. And again, this paper uh, shows that in mice, in, 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 uh, in black six mice, that have been uh, uh, immunized with uh, casein from uh, cow's milk developed severe spinal cord pathology, in particular demonization, uh, which was associated with the deposition of immun immunoglobulin G. Uh, they also, these uh, scientists, they also observed a uh, binding of uh, serum from casein immunized mice to mouse oligodendrocytes in the central nervous system tissue sections and in culture. And they also identified the myelin associated glycoprotein mag as a cross reactive antigen target of these casein induced um, cross reactivity. Not only that, they also uh, collected uh, serum samples from patients with multiple sclerosis and uh, other and a control group of patients with other neurological diseases. And they found that patients with multiple sclerosis had significantly higher B cells and antibody reactivity to uh, bovine casein. Um, so basically the conclusion is that despite disease heterogeneity among individuals with multiple sclerosis, uh, consumption of cow's milk in a subset of these patients uh, who have experienced a previous loss of tolerance to bovine casein may aggravate the disease. And these data suggest that patients with antibodies to bovine casein might benefit from restricting dairy products from their diet. Let me show you very quickly a couple of uh, figures and tables. So this is uh, the spinal cord injury uh, with uh, immunization with uh, lactoglobulin beta, alpha, and casein. As you can see here, casein is, has devastating effects on the histology. And uh, you see here the, the, the demonization of axons, it's higher in casein and the myelin pathology, it's higher in, with casein and is uh, time dependent. The casein uh, immunization day 13, 20, 40, you see, day 20 and 40, the histology. Now, uh, forget about this, too complicated. Um, I also want to show you the data on, uh, on, uh, on the human. So here, not 35 patients with uh, neurological disease and 45 patients with multiple sclerosis. Uh, 
um, as you can see here, milk consumption is significantly higher in those with multiple sclerosis and, uh, and uh, it is also, again, as I said, a higher uh, number of antibodies against uh, uh, casein. So basically, these are very interesting results suggesting that certain proteins of cow's milk that really the only uh, animals that are drinking milk from other animals, from other species are humans because no other animals in nature are using uh, milk from, from other animals. Uh, and um, and uh, these data again are strongly suggesting that uh, casein from cow's milk uh, has an effect in uh, triggering some uh, autoimmune responses in a subset of patients with uh, uh, multiple sclerosis. And there is this antibody cross-reactivity uh, with a certain antigen of the central nervous system that are causing basically alterations of myelin and uh, the disease. And so interesting data, just food for thought. And uh, thank you for listening as always.